Yeah, um, the Attorney General and Minister for Justice, Honorable Godfrey Yabu Adame Okoye, at Ghana School of Law, and Kranasi Okoye, no, when he at church for a face staff and a student aiding kita huo no di etuja at church school sa etre emra e wo mai Ghana mu wona wonti mi eni share so no abain behe na ogu. Ebra ba lo ya peni ono nsa ya suya fo shat enti ne nsem so unu nyamfo go fredi ebu adame edi nsem no e tu jano. Enu wo chile se, legal education anase emra huwa di shuyano. E yadi ya se gane ni ibe biya anase ubi owo wya si biya hunu se asime si e shuyan emra hun adie e wo shuku mwa. Eni ya na chese se eni pano bu ne pa. Eza se bi biya fa emra hun biya no. Nu jwen se se eni pano enim. Enti emma wo mwa juma ye no. Aya na ni pa ebu. Enti se kwa ba ni se e biya sa law school we no bo nsha da eni akande bi obetime dia boa ama omo nso adi suane omo edwumadi omo die na time akon kan ene na chese beba ne se wo mo beto sa school ni mu kura eno de wo nso soso kura anka se bi asa school no wo nya adwuma wo de nsami atu edwa ebra obo ana kokopi emu o Ghana School of Law de e wo makola wo enkran wo ne mpanifuo akyerekyerefuo adwumayefuo ene adi suafuo kokodi nkita ho e wo ho no mo e ma obo akonya ne de to ho e ma adi suafuo bisa bisa ne nsama wo do a wo mo gidi se se wo yi ano that of course will involve SAT reform to involve an amendment to the Legal Profession Act because that sets out the structure of the law. And I think the pop appropriate way to do it is to ensure there's an amendment of the law to that effect. Yes, it will happen, but I think again we must still have an eye on the maintenance of the standards of the legal profession. It's a profession that thrives on standards. Um, as I indicated, the law school is where the theory meets the law and the last stage at which the lawyer is trained. So uh, one way of going about it is also to ensure that the faculties meet the standards set by the junior legal councils. And all faculties who do not meet such professional standards will ultimately be disqualified from running the courses. I think that's happened in other jurisdictions, the United States of America, the US. There is a situation of Charlotte Law School in North Carolina. It was closed down because we are having too many um, field candidates and the standards were quite low. So it is not uncommon. So I think the issue is not just about opening up access, but it's also about coupling it with a strengthening of the standards for legal profession. And all. These are things that we cannot sacrifice in the interest of a nation. Therefore, there is a need for a fine refinement of that process.